Hi guys, welcome back. So today I'm starting a new series of videos that I've been thinking about doing for a little while. I want to start doing a video once a month highlighting a small bookish shop because there are a lot of really great little small businesses making bookish products like bookmarks and candles and today jewelry. So um, today I wanted to highlight one of my favorite bookish jewelry shops, Elisa J Designs, and she just makes the cutest stuff. She also makes like really cute tea infusers and stuff, but I'm just a huge fan of her jewelry. And today all of my jewelry is made by her and I have some other things to show you as well. So definitely go check her out. I will leave a link to her Etsy shop in the video description down below. Yeah, I'm just a huge fan. So I thought I would share with you guys some of the amazing things that I have from her so you can kind of get an idea of the kinds of things she makes and her style. I'll insert a couple of photos here of some of her tea infusers. Those I've got the Enchanted Phantom Box that I work with. Um, so that was actually how I got to know about her was through them, but I'm just like a huge fan on my own now and I've like bought some things. She did send me one piece of jewelry to share with you guys. I'm super, super excited to have. i had been eyeing it for a while, so thank you so much to Elisa for sending this to me. Um, I don't get anything else in return for this. I just love her stuff and wanted to share her with you guys. I will do a close-up so you can see it more clearly, but this necklace that I'm wearing here, if you can see, it is gorgeous. It is hand painted. And you guys, it's a red London necklace. I'm obsessed. It's so cute and so pretty. So if you guys aren't familiar, this necklace is inspired by the Shades of Magic series by Victoria Schwab, A Darker Shade of Magic. I'm planning on actually finishing the series this year, but I loved book one. And if you guys can't tell, um, and I'll, again, I'll do a close-up here so you can see, but look, there's this adorable little coat charm. It's Kel's coat, and there's a really pretty red hand-painted rose for Red London. I just love it. I think this necklace is stunning. I'm so happy to have it in my collection because I'm totally going to be wearing it. Um, some other pieces of jewelry that I have from her, I'm a huge fan of all of them. There's this really cute choker that I'm wearing, and um, it's got like a clock owl on it. It's kind of got a steampunk vibe, so she does some steampunk jewelry which I really love and then I actually the bracelet I'm wearing today matches as well and I love these bracelets they're really cool like these metal wrap bracelets with beads and this one has that same owl clock charm on it as well as a little cute a cute little key charm so I really like that the earrings that I'm wearing today I am a huge fan of I wear these a lot they're Harry Potter inspired but the kind of cool thing about it is that they're pretty low-key Harry Potter they're not obvious so it's always kind of fun when I get people commenting on them and being like oh are you wearing Harry Potter earrings I'm like oh yeah you know you've got a true fan because like yeah they're the Deathly Hallows if you guys aren't familiar so I just love those. I think those are really cool. I also want to share with you guys a couple other pieces of jewelry that I have from her that are some of my favorites. The first one is a bracelet that came in our Enchanted Phantoms box in January, and I love it. It's so pretty. It's Illuminae inspired, and again, I will do a close-up photo so you guys can actually see it. Let me just put it on so you can kind of get an idea of what this looks like. But it is just stunning. The colors on the beads are beautiful. It's got these really pretty charms. I, I am a huge fan. I just think it's such a pretty bracelet. And then the last thing I want to share with you guys, I saw these and I like immediately bought them because I just had to have them. They're these gorgeous Wonder Woman earrings. Oh my goodness, you guys. I adore these so much. They're so pretty. Anyway, she just makes really great, cute jewelry, really fun fandom jewelry, and you know, it's like a nice way to be a low-key fangirl in your everyday life if you don't want to be like full on about it, and not everybody obviously notices it, but I get compliments on, where, on her stuff all the time, so I'm a huge fan. I will try to insert a couple of screenshots of her Etsy shop here as well so that you can get an idea of the variety of things that she has because she makes a ton of stuff, you guys. She's got so many cute things and I I just like love her. So for the month of March, the bookish shop I'm featuring is Elisa J Designs. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have any other suggestions of shops that you would like to see featured. I'm definitely open to that. Um, I would love to work with other bookish shops and talk about their products because I think there's a lot of really great ones and hopefully you guys can find some new favorites yourself. I'm also all about supporting small businesses and Elisa is a mom as well. She's got like an adorable little girl. Let me know in the comments down below too if you guys have heard of her, if you've tried her jewelry, if you plan on it. I would love to hear from from you. I, 
I just love her. She's great um, and super sweet too. So again, thank you so much, Elisa, for sending me this beautiful Red London necklace because I am totally obsessed. And you guys definitely go check out her shop and buy some of her stuff because it's great. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to see more. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.